What's going on everybody and just like all the time with new iPhone that is supposed to be released this year there are definitely some rumors going around and I would like to address one pertaining or regarding the camera it's something that people are worried about and perhaps have too many questions about so I will try to tell you my opinion and some other things that you should probably know about it so let's begin with this video right now. Just like I said, the rumor has something to do with the back camera on the iPhone. So right now you can see that the new iPhones or the new iPhone trend is to have two lenses on the back side of the iPhone and, and people are hearing rumors on the internet that Apple is supposed to add third lens to the back side of the iPhone and there are so many concepts and visuals of how it would look like and people think that it looks terrible and I agree with them. There are two things that you should know about it. First of all, these are just mock-ups and some stuff that people have made in the Photoshop or somewhere else. They're not the real looks of course and that's why it looks kind of off and you can see that something's wrong with the pictures and something's wrong with the three lenses on the back side of the iPhone. However, it doesn't mean that Apple is not going to do this. Of course, we don't know for sure, but Apple may surprise us and give us the third lens on the backside of the iPhone. People generally consider it to be a scary rumor and I don't really think that they have to worry about it because at first if Apple decides to include the third lens and the upgraded camera it's not going to be looking that weird. I know Apple already and we were worried where there was a rumor of the dual lens camera on the iPhone 7 Plus and it doesn't look too bad. We got used to it. Then also there was a rumor of the vertical setup of the cameras as you can see right here and it still doesn't look that bad. So hopefully if Apple decides to put it there it will look somewhat decent. And theoretically, if Apple really decides to put it there, it will probably not be on every single model. Just like when the iPhone 10 was released, there was like one special model with the vertical setup and the other models were having the usual stuff, the iPhone 8 and 8 Plus, where it is something that we were already used to. So if Apple will try to experiment with something, it will probably be like that only the most premium model will have it. I'm talking according to the experience and you can also take a look at it, take a look at the pattern that Apple started to do. And now here comes the question, why would you ever need three camera lenses on the backside of the iPhone? I honestly don't know, Apple has showed us that they are able to do uh, the portrait modes even using one lens on the iPhone XR, using of course only software version of it, but since it doesn't look that different, it's pretty usable. So third lens, it's not something that many people would find really useful or a feature that would make them decide to buy a new iPhone. Maybe it can be just a feature that may attract other people to buy it. I don't know. Away from the rumors, in my personal opinion, Apple will not add the third lens, but you know, when there are rumors, it could also happen. Now, this is it. Uh, please let me know down below in the comments what you think about the three camera setup on the iPhone and what you think about this video down below. If you enjoyed it, then press the thumbs up to let me know that you liked it. For more similar content like this, for more iOS reviews, some best apps for iPads, Apple Watches and stuff like that, press the subscribe button as well and make sure you don't miss the future uploads. Have a nice day and see you in the next video. Peace out, guys.